It's Matt Pinfield Mornings on KFOG. Michael Franti is so cool to come in this morning and hang out with us, and he's going to play for us right now. Michael, what's the name of this song? Is it from the new album, Soul yeah, this, Rocker? this is a song from the new record, and it's called Good to Be Alive Today, and it's just about waking up every day and reading the news and going, oh, man, <laughs> again, like the world is getting beat up every day. And uh, But it's a song about gratitude, and it goes like this. Every day I wake up and turn my phone on I read the news of the day just as it's coming down I do my best not to let it get me down I try to keep my head up, but this is Babylon This world's in crisis, we try to fight it, this changing climate With scientists and with politicians divided by it So many ways we could solve it, but they will never sign it This mountain's tumbling down, but still we try to climb it It's in the Torah, Quran, and in the Bible Love is the message, but somehow we turn to rivals It's come to people always picking up their rifles Another school getting shot up homicidal Some people trying to look fly Some people trying to get high Some people losing their mind Some people trying to get by When you look in my eyes You see the sign of the times We are looking for the same thing But what if this song was number one? Would it mean that love had won? Would it mean that the world was saved? And no guns are being drawn today? What if everybody had a job? And nobody had to break a law What if everyone could say yeah, yeah, That it's good to be alive today Oh, 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 oh Yes, it's good to be alive today Oh, oh, oh Yes, it's good to be alive today Oh, 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 oh. Yes, it's good to be alive today Oh, no matter what nobody say, people used to feel safer when they would hear a siren. Like help is on its way, but now they only think of violence. Another youth in the streets and police is in a conflict. And now we hear the guns click. Yo, Ebola crisis and ISIS is taking heads off. A drone is bombing the village and now the kids are signing up to be soldiers. But they are willing now to do the killing now. But are you willing now? Some politicians out there making up some problems. And trying to tell the people that they can solve them. With TV shows and sound bites and quotes, but everybody knows that it's all about the cash flow. They're telling you and me we're making progress, but tell it to the millions of jobless. It's like a players' club with billions of dollars. To get the votes, you got to make it rain in Congress. Some people trying to look fly, some people trying to get high, some people losing their mind, some people trying to get by. When you look in my eyes, you see the sign of the times. We are looking for the same thing. But what if this song was number one? Would it mean that love had won? Would it mean that the world was saved and no bombs are being dropped today? What if everybody had a job and nobody had to break a law? What if everyone could say, yeah, yeah, that it's good to be alive today? Oh, 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 oh. Yes, it's good to be alive today, yeah. Oh, oh, oh. That it's good to be alive today. Oh, 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 oh. Yes, it's good to be alive today. Oh, oh, oh. We all say, one day, one day, one day, one day, one day, we all will say, that it's good to be alive today One day, one day One day, one day One day, we all will say That it's good to be alive today Michael Franti, live in the studio. That song is great. Thank you, that, man. I love that song, Good Thank to Be you. Alive. You know, the thing I've always loved, by the way, it's Matt Pinville Mornings on KFOG. Michael Franti in the studio with us, performing live. And I wanted to say... You know, the thing that I always found, the beauty of your songwriting, and I mean from the very beginning, no matter what, what, what form you were using, you know what I mean? From the early days with Beatniks and Disposable Heroes, first starting Spearhead, everything that you've done, there's so much socially conscious lyrics in there and, and just so much heart and love. It's the kind of thing that you've always expressed. It's the honesty. And I think that fans of yours like myself and our listeners here on KFOG, 
feel that. And, I mean, the great thing is you just keep coming up with great songs like that. With, with, you, with, uh, you know, reflect on what's happening. I feel like music uh, every day of my life, it takes my stress away. You know, it's like my iPod is my medicine cabinet. You know, it's like if I'm feeling a certain way, I go to, to certain songs that I know are going to lift me up out of whatever funk I'm in. And um, I feel like that's when music is at its best, when it takes pain and it takes stress it takes anger it takes frustration and it turns it into some beautiful expression of that you know and that's why i love you know bob dylan and john lennon and johnny cash and stevie wonder and marvin gay carlos santana rage against the machine run dmc you know the clash they all had that ability to take like whatever frustration and pain people were feeling and turn it into something beautiful and and that's really what to me uh rock and roll is really you know, it's really about that. It's about that being uplifting yeah. and, and giving, uplifting. empowering you with something yeah. positive. Yeah. And some positive feelings to get past all those times. Yeah. yeah. And also just to look and reflect on what's happening. Yeah. I absolutely love that. So the new album is called Soul Rocker. It's going to be yeah. released on June 2nd. And it's on Fantasy Records, yeah, Bay, Area, Bay Area, legendary label that had Credence in Berkeley, right? Yeah. Um, which is very cool. So I'm glad you're you're, you're doing that. Let's talk about uh, the foundation that you've recently. Sure. Uh, you know, it's called Do It for the Love, and you've got a fundraiser coming up. Mm-hmm. Tell me a bit about that. Well, Do It for the Love. Uh, the fundraiser is the day before we play at Bottle Rock, and it's at uh, Low Bear's restaurant in Napa. It's going to be a really beautiful dinner. I'm going to be playing acoustic with a number of other friends, and and uh, but the foundation is kind of like a Make a Wish Foundation for music. So we invite people with advanced stages of life-threatening illness, children and adults with special needs, and wounded veterans to go see any concert they want to see in America. And my wife, Sarah, and I started it. She's an emergency room nurse, and me being a musician, we always thought, how can we bring those two things together? And and to date, in the last two years, we've brought over 600 families to go see concerts, everything from uh, the indigo girls to drake we've bought more taylor swift tickets than i ever thought i'd ever buy in my life but that's you know? great right yeah Making so many people happy. yeah it's and beautiful. lots of country music like it's been really great to see how the music world has responded to so many artists of every genre have said yeah we want these people to come to our shows and we you know we believe in that vision of getting people who need music out to see concerts because music is so powerful a healer as well right yeah. we're going to be back with michael franti in just a little bit you're listening to matt pinfield morning right here on kfog in the studio with michael franti who's so so good to hear here and and perform i said here here sounds like i'm in court or something but <laughs> here here there we go sorry but so michael I, i'd ask you to play another song uh you have your acoustic guitar and it's yeah. always so great to have you strip down like you do when you perform you. acoustically um what song are you going to do for us right well, this now is a song uh i wrote for my other son cappy and it, and um it's called i got love for you and i actually put it out a few years ago on another record uh chris blackwell from island records the great founder of island records had was in a conversation with me one time and he goes you know Mike, you should go back through some of your old songs and and redo them and um you know as if you you know heard the song for the first time and we're and we're gonna do it in a new way so this is one of the ones that i've been playing acoustic over the years but it was done with a full band on on the um uh on on the previous record that we did on all rebel rockers and so i put it on this new record soul rocker in a more acoustic version but it's a, a song that i wrote when he left our home um he you know graduated from high school and he hopped in a greyhound bus and he headed all the way to new york um by bus and i was really sad and missing him and so i wrote him this song so he could uh listen to it on the way it goes like this another morning has come and the sun is high but i know that today is the day that i might cry because I know you're going And I know you're leaving To somewhere Hope to find the peace of mind you're seeking In the back of a Greyhound bus It'll take you far In the back of a Greyhound bus You can be who you are So I say La 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 I got love for you Love for you So I'll be waiting my dear Waiting right here, I'll be waiting, my dear. Waiting right here, I'll be waiting, my dear. Waiting right here. 
for you. Yoo-hoo-hoo. Hi. I remember the time back when we was home. In and out, up and down, of this life for the crazy road. It's been a long time that I should have said what I tell you now. That I got faith in you. And I believe in you So I say In the dark of the night In the hotel when you're alone In the middle of a city Where nobody cares to know On the top of the town In the glimmer of the shining lights You just shine on now You just shine on now And we say La 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 I got love for you I got love for you And I say, la 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 la. I got love for you. I got love for you. So come on, come on, won't you come on, come on, come on, won't you come on, come on, come on, won't you come on, come on. So come on, come on, won't you come on, come on, come on, won't you come on, come on, come on, won't you come on, come on. So I'll be waiting, my dear. Waiting right here, I'll be waiting, my dear. Waiting right here, I'll be waiting, my dear. Waiting right here, I'll be waiting, my dear. Waiting right here. In the back of a Greyhound bus, it'll take you far. In the back of a Greyhound bus, you can be who you are. So I say, la 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 la. I got love for you. I got love for you, and I say la 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 la. I got love for you, I got love for you. So come on, come on, won't you come on, come on, come on, won't you come on, come on, come on, won't you come on home, come on, won't you come on home, 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 won't you come on home. Yeah, Michael Franti in the studio right there. I got love for you from the uh, Newton Dew stripped down version live in the studio uh, at K Fog from the album Soul Rocker, which is out on June 3rd. You can pre order it now, though. You can definitely do that. You've got some really cool shows coming up. You're at Bottle yeah. Rock on May 27th. Yeah, Bottle Rock is an awesome festival for people in San Francisco or anywhere around the Bay Area in Northern California who've never been there. It's kind of we were talking about. It's kind of like uh, the Northern California Coachella, except with wine instead of <laughs> yeah. I don't know ecstasy or whatever, you know. <laughs> and uh, but um, uh, last year I was on the, the 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 culinary stage they call it, and so they'll 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 pair a uh, a famous celebrity chef with with a musician, you know. And and last year I don't know they'd have like Snoop Dogg with some famous chef, you know. And so um, I, I did one of those sessions, and uh, someone in that crowd shouted out michael what's your favorite kind of wine you know and and you know it's napa and they're talking about you know the oaky essence and the it's got an orange underbite or whatever you know (laughs) and i'm like uh my favorite wine is tequila (laughs) and so i wrote a song (laughs) it goes uh you know your love is like a drug to me and every time you're close to me it makes me kind of lose my mind there's not a worry in the world when I'm rolling with your girl And the hours seem to float on by And every time you dance in front of me I feel dizzy like tequila running through my brain The only thing I fear in life is if you with me every day I'll be intoxicated all the time <laughs> But baby, I've been lonely Remembering my time with you so maybe to remind me, you know I just might have a glass or two, cause my favorite wine <laughs> is tequila. Tequila! <laughs> it makes me feel fine, just like you do. Just like you. Perfect for Cinco de Mayo, too. Come on. Right? I mean, you couldn't ask for 
That I mean, song it's is an is, apropos song, right? Yeah, that song is on the new record too. So. That's great. Yeah. That's cool. So that's Bottle Rock is the twenty seventh. That same weekend, you're up in Monterey at the Cali Roots Festival. Tell yeah, us about yeah. That one which uh, Cali Roots is another great Northern Cal festival, and uh, it's a uh, it's sort of a California reggae festival. So Revolution, I think Soja, J Book, so many of the you know Cali and Hawaiian reggae bands are going to be playing there, and and uh, we play on the Sunday night. So if you're somewhere near Napa on Friday, you know it's going to be incredible. Oh my God! The lineup, you know, we're playing, and then Lenny Kravitz follows us, and then Stevie Wonder. Yeah, follows, you know, it's like that's got to wow. be incredible for you to play <laughs> and, with Stevie, then, yeah. loving him since you have since you were yeah. a kid. And then, and then you can drive down to Monterey, or if you're in the Monterey area, uh, you know, go check out Cali Roots. It's going all weekend long, and that's an incredible, just a great vibe. Both both festivals are great vibe. For those who just tuned in, also, uh, do it for the love, your foundation. Yes. You have a fundraiser coming up. Yeah. Are there still seats for mm-hmm. that? Yep. There's, and there's... explain that really quickly. Sure. Dad, it's a, it's at can. the great restaurant L'Auberge in, um, in Napa, and I'm going to be playing acoustic out there on the deck. There's going to be a bunch of other artists from the festival that are going to be coming and sitting in. And um, Do It For The Love is a foundation that I started with my wife, Sara, and we bring people with advanced stages of life-threatening illness, children and adults with special needs, and wounded veterans to see any live concert they want to see in America. And, you, and you've taken people to over 600 concerts, yeah. haven't you? Which yeah, is amazing, Michael. Yeah. It's so cool. Yeah, I mean, you know, that's, that's just a beautiful thing that's given back. Well, I want to thank you for coming in this morning. Let's hear it for Michael. Everybody I don't know. Is required. To clap, and of course, it's it's, it's great to have you here. And Greg, it's always it's always awesome to see you. But the, you know, the two of you teaming up, you guys both are such musicologists. And you know, for people who are new to to Matt's experience, you know, he's he goes way back from I I, I knew you from 120 minutes and MTV and way before that. But he is just a wealth of great stories, anecdotes, and. And any record, like, so if you meet Matt somewhere in North Beach, he's, he's going to be hanging out. You'll, I'm sure you'll see him in a cafe one day. He's hard to miss. Just go up to him and sit down and start talking to him uh, about music. And he, you, you could talk about any genre, any era, from, from jazz to, to hip-hop to punk rock to electronic music, anything. And he'll, he, he, you, can, you can vibe with him. Yeah, yeah it would be great. Thank you for saying that. We yeah. really appreciate it, Michael. Yeah. And I wanted to say, I've got to remind everyone, the new record, Soul Rocker, is available June 3rd. Well, that's when you can get it, but you can pre-order it now, and I, yeah. I really think you should. And it's available on CD, it's available on vinyl, digitally. I mean, you can get it every way. And uh, Thank you. There's a few songs out there right now as well. Yeah, there's a couple cool. songs that are out there already. Well, you know, after you get done with the summer festival season, uh, I'd love to have you come back and yeah, play man. again yeah. and hang out yeah. and talk music because I always enjoy that. We've been doing it since 1991, and uh, I just want to keep the tradition going. Yeah, man. And your tradition with KFOC, which yeah. is fantastic. Yeah. So, Michael, thanks again. Much love to you. Thanks a lot, okay? man. You got I'm going to – it's time for us to say goodbye. The morning flew by. So we'll be back with you tomorrow morning at 530. Uh, Irish Greg, thanks so much for engineering, for uh, for DJing. Putting that record on. Oh, yes, I've been One of your best. I'm now a mixed master. Yeah. I forgot. <laughs> Which was great. Miss Master Greg. 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 That was fantastic. <laughs> I'm going to get you a second turntable. Right. <laughs> there we go. And uh, we'll be back with you 5.30 to 10 tomorrow morning.